Shetty, and this is how to drop D-Tune and use it. Okay, today's lesson I'm going to talk about drop D-Tuning. Now this is going to be geared a little more towards my heavy metal friends, because we're going to put uh, a lot of distortion on this as I like to do. Now, when you're drop D-Tuning your guitar, you're not retuning every string. It's basically your low E string that you're tuning. Okay? You're changing it to the key of D, so you're dropping it down. Hence the term, drop D. Now, if you have a tuner like I do, you can just manually drop D your first string. Because all we're doing is changing your low E string, string closest to you, down a step to D, okay? Now, if you do not have a tuner, please make sure you're somewhat in tune at first, because we are lucky enough to have a D string on our guitar already. Now, if say you're playing a show and you want to do it on the fly, or your tuner doesn't work, or you don't use a tuner for some reason that I don't understand, here's what we're going to do, my friends. Basically, I just, without the pick, take my fingers, thumb on the low E, finger on the D string, which is what we're tuning to. Now, Grab your tuning peg or tuning knob, whatever you refer to it as, and you want to drop it so we're going down, okay? So generally on a guitar, the same style as the one I'm playing on, you turn towards you, okay? Best to figure out which way you're turning first, okay? Um, with a style like this, I'm going towards me. Now, check this out. I'm going to do my best to only hit the two strings, the D and the low E. And I'm going to drop the low E string. Now you can hear it going down. I did that pretty sharp because I've done this a few times. Now, let's just play around a little bit so you can hear what happens if you go too far. You hear waves, okay? Now what you want to do is bring those waves closer together so that there is not any waves at all. It's the same tone, same key, same note. Check this out. I'm going to bring it back up, bring it into key, bring it into the key of D. Now our guitar is in drop D tune. Another way to check is just to strum the top two strings open. It sounds nice and mean, and it also sounds like a chord, which is really, really cool as well. Now, let's just hear if you're out a little bit what it's going to sound like. It's pretty messy sounding. Again, if you want to just go from there, check out the waves. Listen for them. There's that awesome drop D sound. That's how you drop D tune your guitar. Now let's learn how to use it. Okay, now when you're using drop D, you don't want to use the bar chord format on the top two strings. Not on the E and A anyway. You can drop your ring finger down to the D string and still have a really decent, huge power chord. Check this out. Sounds really loud, really big, really powerful, metal style. Now, if we just want to play a normal chord, like we would be doing with our power chords or bar chords, um, we either use the open for the D, you can attach a big D major to it as well. Huge, or the power chord up here. Same kind of thing. The strings match, okay? Now, if we're going to do, say, a chord, all you want to do is bar your first finger. Now, technically, I only like to strum maybe the first three strings. Sounds cool. Put the open with that, and it sounds fantastic in any metal song. You can basically run your finger all the way up the frets. Any finger will do. I wouldn't use your pinky unless you're stretching somewhere. For the most part, Bar your finger, bring it across. That's what your power chord is going to be like on the top. The rest of them obviously sound the same. Because we haven't touched the tuning on the uh, rest of the five strings. It's just the E string, bring it down to the D. Okay? That's how you drop D tune your guitar. That's how you use it. It's really pretty straightforward. Uh, sounds rad though, especially for metal. You can use this for all kinds of stuff though. Lots of bands have drop D tuned. You will find that if you look into it a little bit more. All right, that is how to drop D tune your guitar and a little bit of how to use it. 
Stick around the next lesson. I'm going to give you a cool little riff using uh, the whole D there with the drop tune. Heavy style. Take the riff and use it as you want or just practice with it. My name is Chris Machete. Uh, throw me a thumbs up and a subscribe so I know that you want me to keep doing these lessons. I've uh, dived into the metal. We're doing a little bit more metal than we have before. I like the metal. You like the metal. Let's rock.